Hey guys, welcome back to Dark Angel Beauty. Thank you so much for tuning in tonight. So we are very late on this, but today we are doing our Ipsy versus Ipsy. We just got back from Disney, so that's why it's happening a little bit later than uh, we normally like to get these up. That being said, we're starting with the original Ipsy. Um, if you don't know what Ipsy versus Ipsy, it's a segment we do every month where we take my Ipsy and my mother's Ipsy, we compare the two, I pick out which one I like better as an overall bag, and then I create my ideal bag from the 10 products that we were given. Now, while I was in Disney, I actually had a friend from college message me and tell me that she was excited to see this video because she hated her so much that she actually canceled her Ipsy. So I have no idea what I got. I don't know what my mom got, but knowing that it was that bad that she was that disappointed to cancel it, I was like, oh no, because I have not been liking mine lately either. So I don't have high hopes because if I have high hopes, I have worse disappointments. So that being said, we always start with my mom's. This is my mom's right here. This is mine right here. So here we go, mama's. Oh, the back's cute actually. Kind of plain, but it's like a velvety, nice little thing. Um, I would like to see maybe a little pinker or redder for Valentine's Day, but it's, it's got that feel for it. So, so yeah, not too bad, not too bad. Um, I'm gonna pull out her car just to see. So it's feel the love, cause I didn't know what the, anything about it was. So feel the love. I don't remember what I picked for my product, um, but I, I don't remember what you picked either, so. I just don't remember. Okay, so the first thing she got is an Avet Water Flash Coconut Water Cream. And I actually like coconut water based stuff. I think I've said that before, goat's milk, things like that, coconut milk, I'm a big fan of that, but I'm guessing that it's just like a little, um, yeah, it's kind of like a little moisturizer, very small, um, but not terrible, not terrible. I wouldn't hate that. Um, she Okay, so she also got an It Primer. I guess it's a face primer, not, it looks like the size of an eyeshadow primer. I think I got something similar to like, in my last Ipsy where it's super tiny. Um, I actually really like this primer. I've used it before, but it is incredibly small. Like it is like an itsy bitsy sample size. So not great. Definitely a mascara, but I don't know what the brand is. Maybe Duco, I don't know. It looks like D-O-U-C-C-O -C -C -O or C-C-E, I don't know. But it's the Boombastic Lash Volumizing Mascara. Pretty standard little application wand. Very small sample size in this as well. It's just a standard black mascara. So, I mean, overall, <laughs> just kind of bored uh, with my mom's at least. Oh, okay, this one may actually be a good one. So I don't know the brand. It looks like Kovas maybe. It's a fairy dust pressed highlighter. I'm a big fan of highlighters. I don't know. It's a, it looks like it's a big size. Oh yeah, that's really pretty. And actually that's gonna be a great color for my mother as well. It's very neutral. Um, Almost like a pink, soft pink iridescent. Like you can definitely tell there's like some reflective blue and green in it, which I really like actually. And like I said, it's a good size. I mean, the little packaging is nice on it. It'd be great for traveling, um, which I know because I just made a new travel bag and I brought it with me and I used a bunch of like these size things that I've gotten in Ipsy's before. So that actually is a really good one. Honestly, that's the best thing in her bag that I can see. Um, and the last thing that she got was the Petal to the Metal Va Va Boom Cream Eyeshadow from the Balm. Oh, that's cool too. So I actually for years did not use cream eyeshadows. I'm not sure my mom's gonna like it. She does not like anything like that. Um, just because she has older skin, she does a great job of keeping up and like she doesn't really have wrinkles, but she just feels like, like when she uses glitters and when she uses cream, stuff like that, she feels like it makes her eyes look crepier, which I can understand. So I don't think she's actually gonna like this one, but it's a pretty color and it's a good size too. Um, so I would say of these, the products are not bad. I just think that the black mascara is whatever. We get those in almost every one, so whatever. At least they didn't give us a black eyeliner this month. At least, well, I might have one, but my mom didn't get one. The other two samples are just incredibly small, but these two are really, really good. Um, so not a terrible bag, not the best. I don't think I hate hers enough to cancel it, but we haven't seen mine yet, and mine has been losing every month this, this year, so <laughs> we'll see. Every month this year, I, I guess it's only the second month of the year, but whatever. Here we go, into mine. All right, same little baggie. It is soft. I like the soft feel of it. Feel the love. Oh, hell yeah. Got the same disappointing mascara. Okay, so that is a wash for both of us. Okay, so this is a lipstick, uh, in, in, I'm assuming. Yes, a lipstick. Incredibly small, just like the teeniest. Do you see, like for comparison, do you see how small, you see how small he is? Like. <laughs> Oops, I said a bad word, sorry. Um, it's also sealed really weird. It's like, I'm gonna have to like, got it, all right. Oh yeah, that is daggum tiny. Do you see? <laughs> Look at that 
tiny, tiny. Anyway, uh, pretty color though, uh, very neutral. I think that the size of it is like um, laughable, but I guess like once again for travel, it's not, it, it's not useless, <laughs> um, but it's a pretty color. It actually is more something that I think my mom would like. I think she would like this better than her cream eyeshadow, but what are you gonna do? Then I've got this really nice size Tula Skincare Cult Classic Purifying Face Cleanser. I've never used Tula, but it's a probiotic and superfood face cleanser. And I think I probably will really like it. Like I said, that's a giant size. I mean, especially compared to the tiny little lipstick, that is a really nice sized uh, facial cleanser, which means that actually for traveling, I would really, really like this. So that's actually a nice product in my opinion. And then I got the same teeny tiny little it pore primer and then I got, this is, I know I chose this one after I saw it, I remembered what I chose. Um, it's much smaller than I was expecting, but it is from Chella, this Hello Beautiful eyeshadow quad. Um, I think my mom chose the highlighter. I think that's what she chose and that's why it was such a good product in my opinion. Um, this, I like Chella a lot. I've gotten multiple eyebrow products from them and I am a very big fan of them. So that's why I was like, I've never gotten any of their eyeshadows or anything like that, but I wanna try it. But it's also just a really nice, tiny little eyeshadow quad. It does have a nice dark brown, a light um, kind of like blending shade. And then you've got two really pretty glitter pigments. So I'm excited to play around with that. That will probably also end up in my travel bag just because it is such a nice little size. Um, it's very tiny, but it, for traveling, I don't think that's gonna be a bad thing. Honestly, overall, it's almost a wash between the two bags. I would say just because of the size of the stuff that I got, I would choose my bag over what my mom got. That being said, if I had to assemble my perfect bag, I would do my face wash. I would do my eyeshadow quad. I would do her highlighter, her balm cream based um, eyeshadow. And then we both got the um, primer from it. I know I it's tiny, but I do like it. So I would choose that I think too. So basically two products from each bag and then one that we both received. Um, yeah, so overall, I don't hate it enough to say that I wanna cancel this bag, but I'm just kind of underwhelmed with everything that I've been getting. Um, I know one of the things that my friend mentioned was that she has a makeup heavy bag and she very rarely gets makeup heavy products. And I agree with that. I'm also makeup heavy. I believe my mom is also makeup heavy. And when you look like, technically yes, but I do have like, I feel like I always get cleansers. I always get masks. I always get moisturizers and I'm just like, this month is not a good example of that because I only got one, everything else technically is makeup product, but it's just underwhelming. So yeah, so that being said, um, we'll see how the big Ipsies are. Uh, I don't know what to expect with that either. I've been more disappointed with the Ipsy Pluses recently than I have with the regular glam bags. So um, it's very possible I could be very angry over that or I could be fine with it. Like I said, I don't hate it, I'm just underwhelmed. And that's not really a great thing when you're getting something that's a subscription service that should be exciting for you to receive every month. So I completely understand people saying that they're over it because it is a little bit frustrating. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have not subbed to the page, please do that. We are really fun here. We're a great family. We are almost at 300 subscribers. I would love to see us past 300 soon. Maybe by the time this video posts, we will already be there, but I would love for that to happen. So if you haven't joined our family, please do so. And if you like the video, do give it a thumbs up. And then yeah, other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful night and stay girly with the dark twist.